Welcome to my channel, Celebrity Reading, Intuitive Spiritual Tarot Card Reading for Miley Cyrus. That's who will be this week's celebrity. Um, so let's have a look. Miley Cyrus, what you're going through in your life now. I'm putting one card from the Animal Spirit deck. Fox, okay. So Miley this week, I believe she is observing, she is teacher, she is a learner, she's, she's everything. To, uh, this week for her, it's about listening carefully, watching, um, hearing, uh, seeing, and really, really, you know, acting very cleverly, very smart. You know, she's probably in this like a sharp, um, I would say sharp mind, uh, intuition, and you know risk taking energy so what the tarot card has for her uh, this week so let's have a look she's a very uh, observant and she could be as well um, coached or mentored by someone um, who is a very very I would say in authority who has a respect so maybe by some another celebrity equally or maybe even by the parental you know figure so let's have a look, Miley, Miley Cyrus, traditional tarot cards. Okay, we got the hanged man, we got the hermit, we got the page of wands, interesting, and temperance, okay. Miley is seeking for some uh, downtime and as well she is realizing that certain things are uh, disbalanced in her life. She probably withdraw herself from the public, you know, she withdraw herself from the social media. Maybe she's not, you know, going that much this week or even, you know, the energy itself already has been shown. Um, she has to make certain decisions about her life, about the direction that she is heading, what she is, what she wants in her life, but she suspends this energy. She she doesn't want to make a quick decisions. She knows that certain you no know, decisions need to be made, but she knows also that she's living a life that is disbalanced. You know, there is uh, a lot of disproportional um, energies in her life. Certain things overtaking others and she realizes that this is no good. So she has to make certain decisions when it comes more, I would say, to emotional fulfilling, satisfying, you know, her needs. And when we are talking about maybe connection, about the human interaction, emotional connection, partnerships, you know, uh, romance, maybe she is neglecting that area maybe she's not taking this seriously maybe you know she has obviously had so many disappointments that she's really decided you know not to act for some time and not engage herself in in something very serious so it's been for maybe some time a playful connections you know uh physical um joys enjoyments but nothing really that solidifies her inner self so she knows that and she's um, yeah she is retracting herself you know for herself and uh, what we are seeing the nine of cups emotional satisfaction emotional fulfillment and the star beautiful okay so she is really withdraw herself from the public because she is investing a time because she is probably attracted to someone and here a fan she wants to commit and the highest priestess so she wants to commit she wants to have a family she wants you know to have all this you know um i would say family like uh set up uh However, she doesn't want, you know, to go and uh, tell everyone, you know, for the world, I have someone. And I see in these cards, she, she withdraw herself not to announce, she withdraw herself not to tell anyone about the new feelings that she's experiencing. And because she wants to reflect on those feelings, she wants to understand what she feels. Is it real or is it another game? Is it another, you know toy boy that she you know just having the fun or is it that you really um 
you know, questioning, is it worth for me, you know, to start thinking about more serious relationship. Maybe I have a very serious relationship, which we know her husband, and maybe she's thinking about what she had and maybe she wants to go back and experience, you know, again, the joy and happiness, but she is really, really listening her inner voice and she's not going to rush yet to make any strong decisions. However, I feel it that is to do with the love. I feel that she is really reflecting on the heart matters. And for her, family is very important. And I think the family will have a very strong, um, strong input and strong influence in her decision-making process. So the lady of leprechauns, the messenger, the rocks and the magician she doesn't want to feel anymore as a person that she's the one who heals someone you know who is someone who is not vibrating her energy doesn't mirroring her sort of you know values she doesn't want anymore in her life you know the same sorry you know bs um she is very much i don't want you know to be the healer for someone i don't want you know to be uh a source to you know utilize me as 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 as, as a pot let's say uh, as a pot of a juice you know that someone comes and just you know uh takes takes all you know this the good stuff out of her and she is left with nothing she is feeling that that she had enough in the past of this, you know, um, treatment. And now she's really looking into what is next. Maybe she equally going in, in astrology, tarot, asking, you know, for a professional advice, you know, what the future has for me, um, you know, how, which direction I should go, because I really don't want, you know, again, to get disappointed and burned. And I think she at the moment is experiencing quite, um, I would say, not the nicest energy. She's going as well through quite a rough patch because I think there were some messages coming her way, uh, some sad messages maybe as well from her ex um who are saying you know i really miss you i really need you i want to be with you um uh, let's try and give you know another go but she's really suspending her decision in in making uh any commitments so let's have a look what the final um oracle cards has for us to say there is the habaya there is the piper there is the a fairy uh, kiss by pixies and we have the dressing of salad and dressing the salad okay so miley has uh, a lot on her mind but you know she gets the pleasure and the release of the stress through the music you know when she's really connecting with herself when she is in this poetic artistic uh, mode she releases all the energy and she feels the best when she is vibrating that higher octava when she is actually in tune with her artistic self that is giving for her a lot of satisfaction and that's what she will be doing she will be you know probably creating the music creating the new songs writing the new songs creating new melodies you know maybe even um gathering you know with family and doing this you know more regularly than she had before um but she has so many you know things to really work because on dressing salads it's about that her attention is so scattered she she can't focus in one thing because she feels the pull from all sides and she needs to calm down she needs to find that balance and the message for her is to find the balance to you know connect with her true self um to get you know those answers through through within herself right rather than you know listening what others have to say because every single person that you will reach out will have this uh, opinion but she needs really you know to calm down meditate go into the music go you know do what she likes the best and really find those um, decisions and answers 
uh, from that safe, loving and joyful place in her heart. That is my uh, reading for Miley Cyrus. Um, yeah, I'm got, I got you know so excited myself and I just feel that Miley has so much on her plate and she wants you know that uh, emotional connection um, and I, I, I feel that I feel her energy so strongly um, that my words, I'm losing my words. So Miley Cyrus uh, fans and uh, hopefully uh, Miley herself will see this reading and uh, will benefit in some sort of you know way. Um, have a fantastic weekend guys and I'll see you next week. Take care.